Bula Vinaka guys welcome to another beautiful vlog on this wonderful beautiful day guys today we are taking you guys uh, in a short bicycle trip to our nearby lake which is just 15 minutes by bicycle and show you guys around those boys We are just leaving home now. Talking to you, Connie was talking a lot to our neighbor. Who lives on the top floor from us. Yeah, definitely the road to our house is still closed. So this is the temporary road which we are using. See the road is so dirty because it's gravel in front here the new road is being constructed through the <laughs> Silla farm corn, corn farm and this is the new road this is the corn farm To them, huh? yeah. so now they're cleaning everything mm. and then they will start renovating the house and then they will move oh. end of the year, beginning of next year. Mm. And they're saying, Oh, that's funny because we are also building our house in Fikta. Yeah, and he was saying, So that's why I have seen you sometimes there, like with a different car. And I was just thinking, What's going on there? Like, what are they doing? There's a party going on here, guys. Just two minutes from our house. This is our football stadium here. It looks like it's not that big. It's just like Albert Park. This is guy, guys. This is a super old house, so they break down the old like walls and then putting in the new ones, especially the bricks. Take out the old bricks and they put the new ones. Yeah, this is Sassenberg, guys. Our neighborhood. So this red line, those of you who don't know, this is the bicycle route, uh, bicycle road. So this red line you're not supposed to walk on this red line. You should give always uh, spaces to uh, the bicy bicycle uh, people. I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> I 
I'm breaking the rule. Guys, in summer, during summer, we can swim in this lake. I will show you guys. This is the back, back road to the ice cream shop. This is where the ice cream uh, truck normally comes. Here we are. Here we are. Oh, there is a lot of like bicycle which is parked here. People who travel from other cities and towns just to come enjoy this place here okay, let's go this is our lake it's called Feldmar See, Se is not sea Se means lake If you've been always following us on our vlogs, you would see one of the vlogs. I came here with Connie and we did our picnic here before we had to go to slow. We did a picnic vlog here. And also this place here you can walk around like so the track goes from here around the bush there on the other side and then straight across so this is like three to three kilometers yeah and guys you know what the ice cream shop is so full super full okay you guys have these are some of the menus Connie is just landing to get some ice cream to us. So, this is the name of the ice cream shop, Zanel. They are famous here in uh, Baranda, uh, Sassenberg, and Telfi. Katsiva Kandua. Katsiva Kandua. Thank you, thank you God, for today. Thank you, Andrew, all over the world. Renan, another name, and just show me some more. Samanda. Asios. What's the name? Fafibuna. Who is it? Oh. So this was Connie's choice. Tofibunda. Okay, let's taste. How was the ice cream, my love? My lecker, but now I could eat pommes. Yeah. Pommes with mayo. It's the ice pommes. cream was super delicious, guys. But it's super sweet, mm. huh? Yeah, uh, I'm not a big fan of ice cream. And 
Ice cream, I have two hours scoop. Come three, four scoop fire, so I say that Okay, guys, now we are just walking around the lake. Long time then we are here. Eh? Guys, you can see the the ice cream shop from here. There, where there's those uh, white sand sandy beaches. Bono talanganika, go guys. Bono nika fishing. This is a spot for fishing. Kandua, but before, eh? Not now. Not. Uh, because many people come here, it's always they're like this is one of the uh, near lake. So many people fish here always, so that's why there's not a lot of fishes. Oh, there's fishes, but small size, not uh, good ones for eating. Eh? Guys, you could see on the last vlog when we did the hiking with the church. Man, Connie's parents was the oldest one there. They are over 60, walking that 11 kilometers. Super fit. Huh, they are super fit, fit. And yes. <laughs> yeah, guys, we apologize. I was saying it's five kilometers walk around the lake. No, it's not five, it's two kilometer. Uh -huh. Connie just told me now because she normally do her running here with her girlfriends yeah she said one run is two kilometer yes so we always came here for one round of running and then swimming Oui. Mm -hmm. guys we are so happy that our German football team is through to the Champions League final Bam! What a game when they defeated uh, PSG. Just imagine, guys. PSG, they have world class players who are playing for that club. But some of many of them were, had left, like uh, Lionel Messi or Neymar. Only Mbappe was there. But they cannot break the yellow wall of Borussia Dortmund so our before B team is playing in the finals now with Real Madrid so Real Madrid oh, really yeah that will be hard Real Madrid is always taking the Champions League title and uh, if Bayern like if Bayern would have defeated Real Madrid in the semi-final it would be a chance for b4b this is a big game for b4b it's like david and goliath but who yeah. win david yeah but i we believe we are the big fans of b4b uh josh from moonstar we are the crazy fan of b4b my Tavale Oigan here, Kony, we, we are B4B fans. And yes, Sayrusi, Kali, they go for Bayern. They are Bayern fans. So yesterday, Sayrusi was super crying. <laughs> he was celebrating because Bayern will uh, uh, about to play. Uh, and then when Bayern lost, he was just so angry. <laughs> <laughs> then I said, no, just keep on celebrating. <laughs> yeah. My love, can you say any, sure. like some update about the house? Oh yes, guys. So maybe you have asked yourself why are they not posting anything about the house? It's because we are super busy and we also want to respect some people who are working at our house. So yeah, that's why we are not posting that much at the moment. So yeah, a short update. I was on holidays the last one and a half weeks and we 
improved it super a lot like the clinker is almost finished uh, yeah we prepared everything for the heater which will come very soon and then the roof and the windows so that will be the next steps and yeah it's quite a lot to do Patty was super busy and helping us in the morning then he went for German class then he came sometimes in the evening again and I worked for, uh, with Papa together the full day um, yeah so we prepared a lot of things for Jakob that he can do the clinker we prepared uh, we cleaned a lot of things we start uh, we uh, yeah uh, did some started to do the wall and so on and so on so a lot of things yeah but still a lot of next steps which we have to go but I think like tomorrow or the next days we can give you a short overview or a short uh, update about what what's going on and what has changed so say that you also the next vlog don't say tomorrow yeah. the next vlog the, the next vlog sorry guys so it is maybe for us tomorrow or the or uh, the next day after tomorrow but for you it's the next vlog <laughs> okay that's it and i super guys and i want to tell you i super respect people who are working in the construction field or something like that this is super hard and super yeah it, a job which super makes tired i could <coughs> i could tell when i was working with papa super hard job bless you so like 12 14 hours a day working super hard but yeah i super love it because it's something at his age eh? at his age it's worth it yeah. uh, no matter how hard it is it's for us it's for our future so every stone i have touched something what will bring us closer to the end that's the good thing about building a house see Beautiful the nice sunset. sun Nice, Katsi. Katsi Beautiful Kokondo. husband. Black look, husband. Look, he shaved his beard. Oh, Becca. See, 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 see. So, guys, here, someone is fishing. They want to see your back. Here yeah, guys are some of the villas which you can hire. Here. Yeah. These are villas which you can hire. The water is just calm, man. Guys, sometimes when I see this calmness on this lake, uh, I think about uh, when I was working in the Esauas or at Vomo, like traveling by boat, and when the sea is just dead calm, man. Or we say in Fijian, like kerosene, it looks like kerosene. But I know that this is a lake and it always is calm, but no, you're wrong. Like sometimes these lakes, this lake here, you could also see uh, waves, like big waves. Oh, this family of ducks are crossing. Bula, hello. Hello. Bula. They don't like it. Carito, I'm going to go. 
Ya sir, matanggal ingat apa ya? Which my uncle in the village cook. Uh, he stole the duck from uh, an Indian uh, family, and then he cooked it. He cooked uh, the duck, and then the owner was coming to ask, like, have someone seen his duck? So the owner was asking around in the houses in the village. And then people say, hey, we have never seen your duck. And, uh, and then he, this Indian guy, his, his name is Babu. And then he asked some of the kids who were sitting on the roadside, uh, road going up to the school in my village. And then the kids say, hey, uh, grandfather, uh, grandpa, uh, Mojen. Mojen is the name of my uncle. So the kids, my uncle in the village, man, I, it's hard for me to explain it in English. My uncle in the village always just hang out with kids, not people at his age. He's like 40 something years old, 42, 43. But he's. Uh, gang is always the kids like 12 years old the oldest would be just 15 16 years old and these kids were sitting da down along the beside the road of the of village where babu was walking and ask asking for if someone who have seen his duck yeah, i'll continue the story when we reach that corner because many people are sitting here they're just looking at me vlogging man Just see how good some dogs are trained. Yeah, guys, and uh, these kids, they they call my uncle like Kuku. Kuku means uh, uh, Kuku is not uh, <laughs> this Kuku. Which you know, Kuku means uh, grandfather or opa or kai. So the kids said, hey, Kuku is cooking uh, duck curry. And uh, so my uncle was cooking. The kids are sitting at the road waiting for the curry to be cooked so that they can go and eat. And then went to my uncle and knocked at the door. And then ask, hello, sit down, Manda. And then ask, hey, Mojen, have you seen my ducks? My my duck, only one duck. The rest of the chicken and other ducks uh, like had been found. Only one was missing. The the tamatama, -tama, like the the dead of the ducks, is missing. And then, but 100% sure that Mojen was cooking the, that same duck that Babu was looking for. And then after Babu asked Mojen, have you seen my duck? Mojen said, oh, no. Do you know them? Mojen said, no, I've never seen your duck. Oh, yes. I would like to uh, see the boys, huh? Yeah. Guys, uh, sorry we... Uh, cut the uh, <laughs> the story because 
like one of our super old friends just walked past and from we had, Colombia we have to say hi to them so they are walking there behind so the lady comes from Colombia and then she was working here as a nurse like trainee and then now she's like 100% eh? taking the job like remember the last few vlogs Connie was talking about uh, many foreigners are here working in the hospital and uh, German Germany super needs people uh, especially from other countries because many Germans are not taking up their job anymore mm -hmm. so when she shed, settled down here she was settling first in Sassenbeck and Connie and I was the one who helped her like start uh, with, furniture. with furnitures and uh, uh, like yeah everything about the house like uh, you know sofa, kevia, ndavo, bed, uh, cups, plates, spoons, knife, forks, um, cafe machine we, we supplied it we we gave our we have like three lamb uh, light uh, and then we gave one to them and we gave our coffee machine to them to her and then yeah she met a friend but uh, she had a boyfriend and now they are together and then now recently she had two sons from Colombia they are here in Germany they don't speak English they are just learning German now in school so it's so hard for them they just speak spanish mm -hmm. and yeah so so they just walked by that's why we cut the story and okay i'll jump back to the story and uh, <coughs> babu asked uh, mojen mojen uh, have you seen my duck and mojen said no i've never seen your duck and then babu said hey the kids told me that you are cooking uh, duck curry and then mojen same time mojen no this is not not duck curry, this is uh, chicken curry. And then Babu said, Oh, okay, said, I'm going up to the school and asking the teachers. And as soon as Babu turned his back to go, <laughs> Mojan just looked to the kids and said, Like, Babu didn't know this is chicken curry. When it's cooked, <laughs> it's duck curry. Curry to ambutamanga. So it's chicken curry. When it's cooked, it's duck curry. <laughs> the duck Babu was looking for. So that was the story. Okay, toss a Silly, silly ranga, silly ranga. Juan and Jesus. Now, more than a and I'm done. Tabo Are you on the sofa at home? Sofa. Can you also buy that for our garden? Oh, yes, this is a good bench for grog. No, for um, for um, um, I forgot the word. Uh, no, lovo. <laughs> for lovo. You do the lovo there, I chill. Manda. <laughs> That's one of my music vlog music video i shot it here this place here so that's the place where you can hire some kayak and uh, if you have a speedboat or jet ski that's the spot you have to like take them down to the water also they do scuba here but you just see the seaweeds and there's no corals just seaweeds and sand and some of the things that's normally under the lake I don't know what stones okay, we are just heading back to the where we parked our bicycle to the ice cream shop how was the walk today? super good no, we will eat some vomit. No. Ah, I want to vomit. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, 
Kwani just sing uh first verse of Mbula Male. Mbula Male ake vitika leng a torobo era ya luganga wasana wae me bakaba la sala sa ni mbula ni mbula ke tisaka enda sama re kuni gale Look here. Tuna langi langi enda tinti simbi takayani ya ya ba viti buana ranang Mbula Male ake <laughs> my wife, yeah, my wife, Muni, say. Guys, we are heading back home now, and uh, Mr. Thank Amode, you. Thank you for our video. Have a good day. See you next time, and see you soon, Amode. Sing day, say, sir. No, I already sing. Next, next time, I'll be singing something. So, Sotatale, see you all, and nice greetings from the class and family. God bless you all, guys. Amode, Toso boys. Oh.